Saudi Arabia's regional leadership is viewed more positively than that of Iran in 13 Muslim-majority countries. A poll by Gallup shows that Saudi Arabia's favorability ratings are far higher compared with the Islamic Republic. People were surveyed in countries including Kuwait, Iraq, Lebanon and in the Palestinian territories. Jay Loshki is the regional director for the Middle East and North Africa at Gallup. Thank you very much indeed uh, for being with us. Um, what does your survey tell us then about feelings towards Iran and towards Saudi Arabia in the countries that you surveyed? Sure. First, thanks for having me. Uh, we did the survey across 13 Middle Eastern countries and South Asian Muslim majority countries. And what we're really seeing is that Iran is viewed with a lot of suspicion across this region. It's not a preferred partner of the populations that we've surveyed. But we can also say that these countries are not necessarily um, wildly in favor of Saudi Arabia or any other foreign powers. It's just that Iran does even worse than the United States, China and Russia. Meanwhile, we can say Saudi Arabia is relatively popular compared to a lot of other powers. And while it's been viewed poorly in the United States, a 2019 Gallup poll in the United States showed only 4% viewed Saudi Arabia very favorably. Um, a lot of the criticisms of human rights that Saudi Arabia has come in on from the United States and the Biden administration and from Europe, it doesn't really land in the Middle East in the same way. A lot of these countries maintain relatively high uh, opinion of Saudi Arabia despite that. Uh, and, they, you know, go on, sorry. No, I, I just wanted to say that you know, Saudi Arabia is the custodian of the two holy mosques, mm. and somehow or another, it's playing on on its home field in a way. Uh, Arabic is is the home language compared to Iran, and there's just a lot more similarities uh, across the Middle East for Saudi Arabia that plays in its favor. It's more of an important country in in the culture, uh, you would say. Do, sure. do these do these results suggest attitudes have changed in recent years? Would you say Iran is losing sure. support in the region? I think it's fair to say that. You know, Gallup hasn't asked every single year. Uh, about approval of Iran, we did ask quite a bit between 2006 and 2009. And if we compare that period of time to 2022, we can say that in a lot of countries, support for Iran has roughly halved. So just give you a couple of examples. In Lebanon, 2008, approval was 35%. Today is 19%. Uh, in Kuwait, 38%. Now it's 18%. And we see the same thing in a number of countries across the whole region. And a lot of this can be traced back really to, um, you know, before 2011 in the Arab Spring, it was very easy for anti-Israeli or anti-American rhetoric to land really well in the Middle East. But once the Arab Spring occurred and Iran had to kind of weigh in on Arab politics, it weighed in in a really unfavorable way among many populations. Um, taking the side of the regime in Syria, for example, is something that didn't necessarily go down well in a lot of the region. Uh, its, its activity in, in Yemen would be another good example. Uh, and certainly for Hezbollah in Lebanon, um, looking at that 2008 crisis, um, where, where Hezbollah and, and a lot of Sunni parties kind of took to the streets in conflict. You can say that Iran has um, had to unfortunately kind of weigh in on, in a lot of ways militarily that haven't been popular in the region.